What's your name? Frank Zaylor. What did you do this weekend? Uh, I went X3 at UDS. Uh, dropped around 8 because I couldn't make it to day 2, but technically X2. What deck did you play? Uh, Billy's Oak Frog. Alright, let's get into it. Uh, 3 Salt Frog, uh, 3 Duke, and 2 Roden, uh, 8 Frogs, pretty standard. Uh, 3 Spells, Desires, best card in the game, Pot of Greed. Uh, and then 12 Paleo Traps. Uh, just three of the best ones, uh, the Foolish, the Karma Cut, the Book of Moon, and the MSC one. There's only good ones. Uh, three Strikes and a Warning, uh, pretty solid cards. Uh, D-Berry is bad this format because Dracos are relevant. Um, and then One Horn of Heaven, this is like extra copies of Warning. Uh, if I had a second one, I would have played the second one. It's, it's really good. I think people should be playing two of this. Uh, two Breakthrough Skill, um, Lost One's bad because Dracos are relevant. So just two of this to just deal with decks that you know, for Morel, uh, Danko Seca for game two and three, and whatever else. Uh, one XYZ Reborn, um, just a one of for Revive and Toad and Pin and Under. Uh, three Mirror Force, this is my form of board wipes. Solid in this format, better than Storming. Three Reckless Greed and Spot of Greed. Uh, three Uloku, uh, Filler Card, so it was all right. Uh, make sure Dracos can't beat through your Paleos, that's about it. Uh, on to the extra deck. Uh, three Totally Awesome. Uh, three Opa Binya. Um, it's pretty weird that I was playing three, but I had a lot of room, and every time I make this, I'm trying to make Toad Master Boy, because I use this for Link material, and to uh, empty out my hand of Paleo Traps, so this was just to equal up to Master Boy. And then three normal cards because I really wanted to be able to grind without having to waste toads recycling this or master wood to recycle this. I just want to be able to grind uh, as long as I can because I felt like this was going to be a grindy format, which I guess it is because of pendulums. Um, one cat shark and one sky cavalry. Uh, these are the only relevant monsters you should actually play in the extra deck, I believe. Like number forty-five is, but I don't know. Uh, I did have one Stardust in here. Because uh, I was citing Starlight Road. And then three of the best card, Miss Starboy. Uh, it's like Misses for Water. It's really good. Uh, onto the side deck. Uh, one Max E. Uh, I feel like it's bad this format because of uh, Draco's being relevant still. I feel like it's just, I don't know, I don't like it in the main deck. Um, two Kamungus. I played this over Game Seal. Because if I made Toad Mr. Boy, uh, Mr. Boy would power the game still and I'd have to crash Toad anyways. So I wanted an option where I get to keep my Toad. So that's why I played Kimongus, because it's the only reason why I'm citing this is for Masterpiece. Um, one Regeki, I uh, borrowed it. Dark Hole. Uh, two MSC for Pendulums uh, to deal with the Time Pendulum Graph on my turn. Like, I'll go step four. And then if they end phase or flip the Time Pendulum Graph, I just chain this to deal with it. And also in the mirror match because like it's a spell so they can't respond with paleo traps, and it's just skillful for the mirror specifically, and uh, also Dracos because when they activate the traps, tribute on your turn, just chain it. Um, and then three anti spell uh, had to borrow one, that's why it's not there. Uh, three heavy storm duster uh, still borrowed two of them, don't have them. Uh, this card should be main decked. Uh, this card's a win condition on some. Um, one Starlight Road, I borrowed it, it was awful, never played it, never cited it or anything. And one Torrential for like Light Sword Trinary decks, stuff like that, just another board wipe. Uh, never cited it. Uh, yeah, that's, that's it. Uh, Paleo's really good. It's better than what people think. It actually can deal with Dracos. Dracos isn't good, as people thought. The deck to be is Pendulums. So just play Demise, play Unending Nightmare, stuff like that. You should be fine.